What's up guys, DeekRelaxShacks.com, heading out to look at a bowler camper, uh, kind of the, the egg as they're known, uh, in Brockton, Mass. Thing is, I have no idea what to expect for, uh, from this, it's been gutted, but I do know that these things are worth quite a bit of money, so it's worth checking out, I feel. Oh yeah, of all days, it's 95 degrees out and really humid here in Massachusetts, we're in a heat wave, so this is like the worst day I could do this. But uh, there's no time like the present, as they say. And I have four back here. Uh, these two, two more back there. She like, you don't have time for all this. All right, here she is. My main worry is I see a tarp. And I'll show you kind of why that's there. And, uh, you know, this sucker's pretty old, so you can get some wear and tear things like this right here. You can see there's a newer spare, which is cool. Here's the undercarriage. Which looks decent enough. Like I said, if anything, uh, it could be used as a simple shed for the money. Definitely some retrofitting, none of the original stuff. Kitchen wise, any of that left in here? Need some love. All this rubber gasketry, if such a word exists, is losing it a little bit. This is the culprit, I guess, of a leak over time where the ceiling's sagging a little bit. And that worries me, but I know they took all the stuff out of here, so it took away some of the support. So I would think and this was put in here for snow loads, which he says does make sense. Kitchen, everything looks in decent enough shape. So there it is, kind of the whirlwind tour, because the guy was right behind my shoulder. Uh, very nice guy. Uh, I'm in the Home Depot parking lot right now. I've got to buy paint, some concrete, some other stuff for a treehouse build I'm doing for somebody, which is also being chronicled on this channel. So check that out. Please subscribe, uh, leave some comments. But what do you think? I know I'm not giving you too much to work with, because that was a very short video, uh, whirlwind tour. Uh, the door, something like that because it's curved linear. You know, I got to replace some of the gasketry using that word again. Uh, the roof, it just seems like it needs some bolstering. And uh, I could cleverly, if I worked in a little, you know, some divisional closet or some kind of kitchenette unit, probably could beef that up again. And, uh, you know, it's unfortunate that all the original stuff is pulled out of there because there's probably some money value and beauty and those things. But it's not there. It is what it is. And that's the reason it's uh, pretty inexpensive. So do you think it's worth the purchase? I'll tell you the price, because I didn't tell you that earlier. 1400 bucks, all right? I kind of figure, I don't know if I have space for it. If anything, it would make uh, for a cool looking shed. Put a little deck in front of it, put a little shade trellis, you know, a couple chairs, some of those firefly lights, whatever, all those cliches might be kind of cool. So if anything, I probably could flip it for like double what I'm paying for it once I clean it up. But you be the judge. What do you think I should do, fair viewers? Again, appreciate your viewership. Thanks for watching, as always. Uh, not much razzle-dazzle with this one, but it is what it is. And uh, we'll see you guys later. All right, take care.